You did a Jean-Luc Godard film, which is playing in the Alliance Francaise Festival, Soin Tes Droites. Mm. That is the most bizarre cameo. What was the direction in that bizarre scene? You're in a car at the road. It seemed like, was it just he gave you dialogue that day? That's his process, supposedly, as he gives to people. No, no, no. That, that's Rivette does that. He oh, doesn't Rivette. give you a script. <laughs> wow. He doesn't give you a script. <laughs> with with, with um, Godard? Yeah. With God, it was just a nightmare. What was it like? What was it was that a like? nightmare. It's a it was bizarre every... cameo. You just show up. Yes, and but you're I gone. mean, he's a bizarre person. He's <laughs> he's he's so irresistible, which obviously I've got something in me that likes people that are, <laughs> can be very painful, and I was told he'd be painful, so I tried not to take anything personally. When he did a close up on me and he said, "We're doing shit. This thing is shit. The whole thing is shit. We're doing nothing but shit," I thought, "I will not take this personally. It's not about me that he's talking. He thinks it." Probably psychologically, he thinks he is shit himself. Therefore, <laughs> anyhow, I worked it. I worked it out so as not to be pained. But I didn't think I was doing frightfully well. He was wonderful when he told Villeray what to do. He pulled up my hair and he went over my face with a sponge. He said, "Because you, you've only got this sponge in this car, but you want to get at this girl." It was about frustration. Right. And then he said, "Pull the." pull the suitcase from behind her neck so it will jerk back. And when he did it, God, he nearly broke my neck. When Villeray did it, he was much more tender. When Godard did it, he was a great actor. Mm. And it was, a, it was about not getting it up any longer. Mm. That's what it was. it was. It was a thing of having this person that you couldn't touch apart from cleaning her car. So clean her face too, hurt her a bit. And that was Godard. And I think he's like that. And I think that's why he was a great film director, albeit very tiny in the film. And then as I said goodbye to him, it was raining, I said goodbye, uh, Godard. And he, he was cleaning the tripod, he didn't even turn around. He said, I'll, I'll give you a check to your agent. So I was so cross when I went back to my hotel that I wrote out a note saying, I'll only, I'll only give you the bill for one day and not two because it had rained the day before. So I only counted him for one day. Went down to the south of France with Jacques Doyon. I got a phone call to say he wanted me back again. I thought, damn, it's because I wrote that note saying that he had to be able to pay for one. Went back again. And I said to Caroline Champotier, why? Well, she said, I think that he just wanted to do one take because he thought that one that camera angle could have been done by somebody other than him. Wow. So I did. Just and I can't thing. pretend for a second he wasn't attractive. He was divine because he had, what's more, he was ill. I love people that are ill. He w he'd got a cold and he'd got at least three mufflers on and he was <laughs> he'd got a fever. So everything that was attractive.